everyone welcome to frankie finds so today i've got something really exciting if i do say so myself it's a massive absolutely and i mean massive timu haul it's that big i'm having to do it in two or three parts so bear with me on that score but i'm hoping that you enjoy it I'm hoping that you enjoy the stuff that I've actually bought. Um, I will put in the corner of the video down below. Every time I show you an item, I'm going to put how much it costs me in the thing so you can see. Just rather than me having to remember it off the top of my head or write it all down. Because it'll take me ages. But yeah, let's just get started. So, the first item is a little basket. I don't know if you can see the colour very well. It's like a light bluish purple lilac-y. And it's got two shelves. It doesn't come like this. It comes just in like the four things and then you put it together. It did take me a good five, ten minutes to work it out how to actually do it. <laughs> um, can't remember off the top of my head how much this costs. But like I said, I will put it in the uh, corner for you to see. Um... I was thinking for this for my dressing table, but I think because it looks a little bit cheap, um, I think I'm going to put it in the bathroom instead and just put toiletries on it. Um, but I don't know yet. We'll see anyway. But yeah, that's the first item. I do quite like it, actually. Second item is some crops. Not owned a pair of Crocs for years, since I was a teenager. The only thing is, apparently, when I ordered, I ordered a six and a half, which is massive, because I'm only a four and a half, five. So, these I'm going to just give away, see if anybody else wants them. They smell nice. They smell a bit like, like a lip balm. Yeah, like berries or strawberry. Oh, yeah. But, yeah. Like I said, I don't know how I ended up ordering the complete wrong size, but there we go. I'll have to um, just reorder them again in another size. They're only cheap anyway. So, third item is this tiny, it is quite cute, I must admit. It's just a tiny, it's a 280 mil, and it was 99p. I just whacked myself in the face with it. <laughs> um, 99p, it is tiny. Neck. <laughs> Good job I caught that. Yeah. I must admit with this one, I didn't realise how small it was until I'd already ordered it. And then when I looked back, I saw it was only 280 mil and I was like, yeah, that's going to be tiny. <laughs> no wonder it was only 99p. But they do have like the bigger sizes. Obviously, the bigger the size you get, the more it would cost. Next item is something really fluffy. It is literally just a makeup or pencil bag and it's really fluffy. It's like a cream colour. It's so fluffy, lovely and soft. Nice quality, I think, for the price that I will have paid. Can't, I can't remember how much this one cost, to be honest. But yeah, they had loads of different colours available. Um, but this one was my favourite, so I went for this one. Nice size as well. Good for travelling, I would say. Don't know if I'll ever actually use it. Because to be honest, I've bought loads of stuff for makeup and that. And I don't really use it that much. But it was only cheap. So bear with me while I get the other bag of stuff. Next item is this one. This is a back scrubber for the shower. Again, with this, I think they had different colour options. Let's have a look at it. If I can open it, I might just rip it. It'll be easier, I think. There we go. Yeah. So, it's literally, it's got nothing on that side, which I think is a bit of a shame. Um, but on that side, it's obviously got the loofah. And then, yeah, you just literally put your shower gel on and do your back. I think it's a really good idea. 
um, just because I always find that I just never do my back because obviously I can't reach. So it'll be good to actually start doing that. And I quite like the colour as well. Nice and long. Yeah. Next we have got just a boring one. Just bought some loot, uh, loot, <laughs> link rollers. I like the pattern on these. Just because my partner works in a cotton factory and he's forever coming home with yellow cotton on him. And it gets everywhere. It gets on my clothes, gets all on his clothes. So every time I go out, I just feel I look a mess. So I bought these just to, before I leave the house, I'm just going to do it every day just to make life easier. Next item is this. So again, this can either be used from a back or for your feet. And it's literally something that you put in the bath. And get it open. And you literally just put your shower gel or um, whatever you're going to put there. And then you can either put it on the floor of your bath and do that with your feet. I bet it feels really weird and tickly when you do it. Um, or because it's got these things on the back, you can just stick it to the tile wall and do your back a bit like Baloo the Bear, you know? But yeah. I like the colour. I can't remember if you could order different colours in this. Yeah, can't remember to be honest. Next item is another box. I have no idea what it actually is. Does it say? Ah, yes. This is so cute. And this is definitely going on my dressing table. And I've dropped a piece of it. Where's that gone? Where has that gone? Oh, it's there. So... This is a cotton bud holder. It's plastic and it got a little lid. And you put them all in this bit and then they just come out of here. And then in the morning or whenever you use them, you, they just all fall here. This was only cheap. I'm sure it was a one pound odd or something like that, but it's just nice. It's nice and clear. And I think it looks nice. Even though it's plastic, it doesn't look like cheap or anything, I don't think. So, yeah, I'm quite happy with that. Next item is this one. A handbag. I must say, everything I've got is really well packaged. Um... There was a few items where it was like they were in gift boxes, but the boxes were a little bit damaged, um, which is a bit of a shame because then you can't give it as gifts. Um, I mean, I didn't buy any of it specifically to give as a gift, but, you know, it is a bit of a shame that I can't give it as a gift. So it has a big thing in the middle, and then it comes with a shoulder strap. Oh, it comes with a necklace. Oh, no, it doesn't. What is this? Ah, oh, it's a little light bag charm. Oh, that's lovely. I didn't realise it came with that. Got the... Oh, I'm going the wrong way there. Got, like, the thing, the clip. It has got a bit of a mark there. Oh, but it's just rubbed off. But, yeah, that's the back. And that's the front. Got, like, little metal tags, handles, should I say. Looks like that inside. Quite nice and roomy for the size. I must admit, when I did order it, I thought it was going to be bigger. But this was, again, really cheap. So I can't really complain. Uh, I wonder where I would put this. Do you reckon on here? Maybe. Yeah, that is lovely. I really love it. And I think, again, with this, there were loads of different colours I could order. But this one was my favourite. Yeah, I'm really happy with that. It's lovely. Next item. I've already had a look through, if I'm honest, at everything, but still exciting looking again, because again, I forgot what I've ordered. So I've got a shirt next for you guys. This is amazing. If you're a Harry Potter fan like me, then you'll love it. 
I'm hoping you can see that. So it literally just says, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. And I think this was six pound odd. They go up to a size 8XL, which is amazing. And I think 8XL is equivalent to a 32. And I think that's brilliant because normal clothes stores like Topshop or something, they go nowhere near up to that size. So I think for plus size people, it's great that they do those kind of sizing options. But yeah. So that's that one. I will show you this shirt as well. I think I showed it in another video, but I'm not sure if I'm completely happy with that video. So I'm thinking that I might redo it. So I'll show you this one anyway. I'll stand up. So I've literally just got this on. It's lovely. And again, this was about six pound odd. It's crazy. And I did also order this in yellow as well, because I couldn't decide whether I wanted black or yellow. So I got both that as well. And that one looks like that. It's lovely. Keep saying lovely on everything, but that's because it is. <laughs> I must say, the sizing is really generous. Really happy with the sizing. Next item is a travel wallet. So I have already got one of these um but it's got like a stain on it i don't know where it's from but i thought it might be time for a new one so yeah it just opens up and there's all the spaces again this was only cheap but yeah it's got like the zip bit there and then all the pockets but yeah We'll go on holiday in September, I think, so we'll definitely use that then rather than the one that's got the stain on. Next item is these. Just a bit boring, but um, just to, um, some gloves for washing the pots. They've got those, like, bristles on the gloves and you literally just put it on. And then that's what you wash the pots with rather than a sponge. Get it on? Yeah put your uh, sink in and everything you know obviously you know what i'm talking about don't even know why i'm explaining it <laughs> and then you literally just do that on the pots so yeah i'll definitely give them a go next item is another bag <laughs> So this is literally, it's only tiny, I think they call them like literally just phone bags. Um, but I loved the fact that it was like cat ears. And it just opens with a button. I like the um, zip. Nice little round disc thing. And it's got a strap, which is good. And then, yeah, literally just enough room for your purse and some money. And a little, maybe some uh, tiny little makeup bottles or something like that. But, yeah. Yeah, that's quite nice. Be good for holiday, I think. Next item of the evening. I must admit, I've not even tried these yet. So, I'm hoping I've ordered the right size in these, unlike the crop. Don't know, again, I don't know how I managed to do that. So annoyed with myself because I was looking forward to them as well. These are a size... I can't remember now. Uh, I'm assuming I would have ordered like a four and a half to five. But they are so fluffy. Just for around the house, you know. Just for walking about so my feet don't get cold because... My feet always get cold. Even in the middle of summer, I'd say they still get cold. But yeah, yeah, I'm really happy with them. Next item. Ooh, yes, remember these? Sunglasses. So again, I think these off the top of my head were less than two quid. They've got like that little detail on the outside. 
I mean, yeah, they're cheap, but for going on holiday for a week, you don't want to be spending loads of money. I can't afford to spend loads of money, to be honest. But I'm really happy with how they look. I feel I look a lot cooler <laughs> uh, with these on. These are really nice. Yeah, and again, like they were less than two quid. It's crazy. I don't know if I explained at the start, but Timu is, if you've never heard of it, it's like a Wish or a Sheen or an AliExpress kind of shop. Um, the delivery took about a week, to, maybe a week, eight days, something like that, um, which I think is really quick because when I used to order off Wish, it took like a month to come. Um, Timu does also offer at the minute free delivery, uh, which I think is great. And I will as well, if you do want to place an order, if you use the referral code in the comments below, it gets you, gives you like £100 worth of coupons. So definitely, if you're thinking of ordering, definitely use that code. Next item is a little lunchbox with llamas on or alpacas. And let's open it up for you. There we go. And it's insulated inside. Lovely and roomy. But yeah, this will be perfect for when I'm in the office. I can just literally go put all my lunch in here, put it in the fridge when I get to work, and there we go. Because usually I just take like, either try and squeeze it in my bag, or I take like a plastic bag. So at least this is a little bit nicer for me. And it was only about three quid, I think, off the top of my head. Next item is this it's a shower head <laughs> it said on the description that it's like a power shower um but for the price of it i don't know but i might get my partner to put it in the thing and replace it tonight and just turn it on just to see if it is a power shower i'm hoping so but for the price it probably isn't it's got a little button here and it's like off and on And you just push it so we shall be testing that oh it moves don't know really what that does whether it changes like the pressure or something i don't know we shall test next item is these so it's one of the rolly sticks can't remember what they're called and you just do that oh that's cold and when you've got like your face cream on or a cleanser, you just rub it in like this. I don't know if it has any benefit at all, but it feels nice. It's very cold. Um, and it's got a little one as well. And then it comes with a guava. I can't remember if that's the right word for it, but that's what I'm going to say, a guava. <laughs> and again, I think with this, you're supposed to do that or something. I don't know but this probably won't get used i was more focused on wanting this to be honest i love the color and again with these i think there was a few different colors you could order i'm just enjoying the coldness of that to be honest <laughs> oh well yes i did order one of these on their own uh it was a similar color but it was a bit darker um, but it was broke when it arrived. It literally snapped in half. Um, but all I did was I went on the app, uh, requested a refund and sent a picture of it broke. And they refunded me. Um, well, they gave me the option to either add it as credit onto my account or refund it to my original payment method. So I thought, well, I've got some stuff in my basket anyway. So I'll just add it as credit. So And it literally went on straight away. So, But yeah. Nice little item there. I love the colours. Next item. Got a few things here. Is a lipstick. And it looks like that. It's number 10, apparently. Oh, no, number one. I love the actual bottle of this. I think it makes it look really nice. And it's called Hand Iron. Let's have a look. And that's what it looks like. I think that's lovely. Let's try it. I don't usually like to do this, but I'll try it. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's lovely. Got to remember not to touch myself with this now. <laughs> but yeah, might as well give it a try. Next item is this one. And I've dropped another thing again. Where is this one now? So the next item is a clip, a hair clip. This is smaller than I thought it was going to be. So I'm not sure whether I'll use it. If I can open it. But it is a lovely pattern. It's a little hair clip. It's gorgeous. They had about three different colours in this. Um, again though, it's a bit smaller than what I wanted. Um, so I'm not very good at hair and makeup, so I wouldn't know how to do anything with it, really. I mean, you know, might have to ask my uh, stepdaughter what she would do with it. Just put it in there just so you can see. But it's a lovely design. And again, maybe a pound or a pound odd, I think. Next item is another hair clip. This one is actually a decent size. So that's good, at least it was one hair clip that I ordered that came in the size that I thought it was going to come in. But yeah, actually just like that. It's lovely. Look at that, massive. So this one will be very easy to just do. I mean again, look, that looks terrible because I'm just like showing you but... Yeah, if I give myself a bit of time, hopefully I'll be able to do it so it looks nice. Next item is a lovely little brooch. Don't know really why I ordered it, because I don't really wear brooches, but it was nice and it was about a quid, so can't complain. Look at that, that is gorgeous. Absolutely lovely. And how do you open it? You literally just push it down. And then it comes out. But yeah, it feels quite nice quality. It's, it's when you shake it, it feels a bit tinny. Um but the pattern in itself is lovely, I think. And I think if I'm careful and I only wear it every now and again, I'm hoping that it won't lose all its stones like really quickly. But yeah, I like that. Next item. This is the hardest thing is opening all these there we go again it's a bag job brooch and it's literally stranger things i'm just checking it's spelt correctly because i've uh, heard a few things don't know if you can see that it's got two thingies on the back but yeah you could just stick it there again i don't really wear stuff like this but i'm thinking i've bought a few so i might just start trying And again, I think it was about 80p, something like that. Another one. I'm basically just ending with all the badges that I ordered, if I'm honest. This is another Harry Potter one. And it literally says, don't let the muggles get you down. And it's like a pair of glasses with a lightning bolt. And again, it's got two things on the back. I think that's really cute. I love that saying, don't let the muggles get you down. Might get that as a tattoo, you know. The last badge that I'm showing on this video, I've got another full bag to do yet, but I don't want this video to go on too long, so I'm going to do that as a part three. And this is literally another badge, and it says just one more chapter. I love reading, so I thought that was really relevant to me. And again, I think it was about a quid. Maybe even less. Next item, and I think that is, I've still got a few left, but I might end it on this one. It's literally just a tub, plain tub, and I thought it would just come in handy to put a load of stuff in. And um, yeah, so I'm going to end it there and I'll do another part three just because I don't want to drag on for too long. It's already been 25 minutes. Um, but if you enjoyed this video, give me a like, subscribe, um, Leave a little comment down below of what you thought of the ad, uh, the I, I does, I can't speak, of what you thought of the products. But thank you so much for watching if you've stuck with me the whole 25 minutes. Bye!